Hey guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, we finally did it. We made some progress for the first time in like a week. Um, if you're enjoying the videos, check this out. We got a ton of stuff in the shop. I don't know why, but they're going crazy with the shop offers this week. So, um, yeah, attack more. That, I mean, if you, if you buy instant training, or even if you don't and you just want to, uh, you know, well, you want to buy it then it's right here. This is an amazing deal. Uh, extra builder is free, so make sure you grab that. Uh, 14 days, instant training. Um, also a nice deal. I honestly forget how much it cost. And then we had, uh, where's the huge one? For, where's the, yeah, this one. Okay, this is the $1 one that everyone bought. So if you're gonna grab any of these, appreciate it. If you throw in that code chicken in the shop, it does uh, expire every week. So appreciate it if you take a peek. And check your code chickens in the whatever. All right, so here we go. We got rank 22. We finally did it. And uh, honestly, it was pretty easy. It was pretty easy. So what we needed was 6 ERs and building health and this base. Great base for 6 ERs. I realize a lot of you probably aren't here just yet. But uh, I think what we did made a lot of sense. So what we did was we skipped troop health and bombers. And we went straight to 6 ERs and the building health. Now we're at a bit of a crossroads. Do we keep going ahead? Adding more defense, grabbing a prototype. Um, you know, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab troop health. We'll see how the bombers are going to work, but uh, I definitely want the troop health regardless because if I'm heavy rushing, which is all I'm doing right now, um, troop health is going to make it that much stronger. How much does this cost? 1.3. And we need one more chest for this. And how many are we getting per chest? 450. I don't know what the math is, but I think... Wow, <clears throat> what does it cost to max out troop health? I don't know off the top of my head, so I'm not gonna max barrage right now, um, but I will show you guys the attack and hopefully we can make a little bit of progress here. So here's the whole tech tree, guys. Um, and I think this is gonna be a viable route, even if you're falling behind a little bit. Um, I would skip bullet. I don't think he's a huge push point, unless you're using seekers and you're really good with them. Um, you know, that's where bullets gonna be nice. Um, if you're really struggling, you know, just use bombers. They're going to be easier to use, uh, a little bit less than the gunboat energy as well, opposed to the rock choppers or whatever else you're using, or heavy chopper rush, for example. So, yeah, I think bombers are the safe route. If you can rush it, go to six and building a little bit early, but bombers are going to be great. So we're on a six times win streak. So let's see if we can uh, let's see if we can keep this going here. I don't know if twenty three is going to be open. Maybe once we get the troop health. Um, I am going to be streaming that later, so make sure if you want to see if you want to see live streams, make sure you check out the channel. It's just called Chicken Gaming. Um, I I go live basically whenever it's a good push point, and I'm at home and I have time to stream. So usually a few times a week. Um, what I should do is start using the low level account and just streaming that stuff. But uh, yeah, we'll figure it out as we go. It's just you know I only have so much free time, so that's kind of how my streaming goes but uh yeah so heavy chopper rush at 6 er here is how i'm doing it let's go like this and we're gonna flare them actually all the way down here and the only thing we got to worry about is the uh the shock launcher so typically what i'll do the bases aren't usually set up like this usually there's an engine right there so i'll free clear to that one then flank left and then by the time that the heavies come down this way i'll do a, a critter um a critter shock Ooh, we lost a heavy chopper. That's not good. Um, 8 plus 7 is 15, so there we go. So I'll do something like this. And what that'll do is it'll distract the shock launcher. Uh, and we just got to make sure that we, uh, that, we, that we shock any splash damage. Right? So we had to make sure we hit the machine gun and the flamethrower. That's just going to give us a little bit of time to build up those heavies. Um, unfortunately, we did lose that heavy chopper, so that actually is going to hurt us um, as we push through here. But... Then it's free clear, and then it's flaring. Um, so, I mean, the attack's not too hard. With four and four, um, rank four barrage and rank four artillery, I believe it is three barrage and two artillery most of the time. Sometimes it gets tricky on me, but, um, yeah, for the most part, that's usually what it is. And there we go. So there's our third one. I'm just going to clear all this stuff in here. Um, there's a lot of shock finds there. I find when, you're when you just let the heavies kind of spread on their own naturally and run out, uh, they do a better job of not all running atop the shock lines at once. It looks like this guy is getting a sweet time. Um, so let's go ahead and try to speed this up a little bit. 
I don't know what that was. I think it was more than uh, the amount that I said it was. Let's go like this. We also have smokes, so I mean we can use those. Uh, what I really need to do though is I need to clear the shock mines. And yeah, so the times for 60R with the building health, they, they've really been around 1 minute and 30 seconds. Uh, that's kind of the time you want to stay above. It looks like this guy's getting a, a really good time on us, so I think that's kind of out of the cards on this match, but hopefully we can uh, we can get it to work here. Fake retreat, fake retreat, fake retreat. No, sir, let's go, let's go. I hope it's not a fake retreat, maybe it's got critters or something, I don't know. I'm always getting trolled here when I, when I make the videos, it never fails, but... Yeah, let's take it, dude. I, I bet that was... My guess is that was a... Uh, well... It probably wasn't a secret fizzle. It was probably a heavy chopper, rocket chopper fizzle is, is what my guess is. Because he lasted a long time. So minute 40, that's solid. It doesn't seem like much. But that is uh, that is solid, guys. Mr. Hammer. Very cool. Alright. Let's see where we got. So 22 and 19. So let's see what he did. I'm interested to see that. What was he using? Yeah, it was a heavy chopper. Oh no, it was heavy chopper seeker. Uh oh. That's scary. Well, at least we know we can stop them. That's good, because I think he had bullet too, didn't he? Or maybe not. Maybe no bullet. Anyways, who cares? Crush the seekers, as we have been doing pretty much, you know, other than 4 yard for probably the better part of the season. You know, don't want to throw any shade, but we've been doing well against them so far, so. All right, let's get into uh, the next attack here. These attacks... I feel like these attacks take so unbelievably long for how early we are in the season. I know we're at 60 hours now, so maybe that makes more sense, but um, I felt like that was the one kind of downfall this season, uh, or like gripe or complaint I would have. It's just that it got, you know, too kind of defensive too early on. Ooh, this is different. This is a... Wow. I don't know if we can heavy chop rush. I have not seen a base like this. He's got the building health too, damn. Um, okay, shoot. Literally no idea what I'm doing here. This is a, this is a prime bombardier base. They would just rip through this no problem in like three minutes. Um, but without them, that's going to be tricky. Hi, oh, boy. Um, the problem is with all this clustered stuff is I'm going to get about halfway through and I'm just going to lose all my heavies and then we're just going to be down to, to heavy choppers. And we're just gonna have nothing left in the tank. So, this is just a shot. In the, this is just a, a shot in the dark. I don't know if this is going to work. So, pray for chicken in the comments, guys. But we're gonna go for it. I'm gonna use the the rocket choppers because I don't think we're staying alive. Especially maybe if we had troop health and we were doing a heavy chopper rush against this one. Without it, absolutely no way. Absolutely no way. Okay, let's shot there and there. We gotta give ourselves just a bit of a chance here coming out of the gate. I mean, as long as we keep shocking stuff, we might be safe. Let's see. We got all the heavy choppers in the world that we could ever want uh, on the left. Um, so we just gotta keep our gunboat energy here open on the right. We gotta keep shocking stuff. The the important thing is to keep the um, the heavy choppers alive while they're dumping out heavies. That's what keeps them alive. Um, it's uh, it's getting the heavies to to have the uh, the targets switch off them if that makes sense. Okay, I got a reflare here. We got to get moving. Um, I got to get heavy choppers in front of my rock choppers, or we're not gonna be having a good time. Okay, okay. I don't like where that one exploded. He might have targeted a rocket chopper. Look at how long this is taking with the building health. <laughs> like, it's crazy, crazy, crazy. Okay, we don't have a shark just yet, but I'm gonna throw critters there because I think they'll uh, they'll get some decent value. I mean, as long as we can finish this guy, I think we're gonna have a chance. Um, but it's gonna be tough, man. It's gonna be tough. He's already got us down to two. Looks like the cannon targeted the rocket chopper. No, okay. We're somehow keeping them alive. Shock here again. Keep stuff alive is the name of the game right now. Um, but da, 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 da. what I might do actually next is bard out a cannon. 
that's in kind of a gross spot. Actually, no, I think I need to save. I think we need shock bombs. I think we, everything's got to be shock bombs in this one. Okay, okay, 24. I mean, even when we take this down, just using, you know, 4-4, four, four, I'll be happy with that. Obviously, I'm pretty sure we're going to lose. I don't think we're going to win this one, guys. Um, okay. Yeah, there he goes. But we'll do our best to finish it out. I mean, that was a tough one with what we had to work with. That's, you know, not really ideal. Okay, there we go. Keep the critters up in front. And yeah, I mean, the, the difference was there. Uh, obviously, we had to use HCRC, which is a little bit slower than full bus rush mode. Um, so there's that. And I had to use all my extra GB on shocks because look at the heavy choppers and the heavies that we have left. Not many. Um... So yeah, we had to do that, and 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 that didn't allow us to take down the sky shield, so we couldn't flare early, right? So we had to just kind of sit and clear the whole base. So solid base. If you're not facing, um, I feel like seekers would rip through that. No, um, yeah. So I mean, solid base. You're getting hit with HCRC. Um, no way. Are you kidding me? I forgot we scouted the whole time. <laughs> Let's go. Yo, that was amazing. Two second win. Ah, oh, I thought we were done. I'm so dumb. I always forget the scout times. That was awesome. What a great video. So I hope you guys enjoyed that one. As always, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to... Um, how do I usually end the videos? Uh, leave a like if you found it interesting, entertaining, or informative, or you're having a good time. See you next one, guys. Chicken out. Rack, rack.